where I live wasn't great. Never really was. Then enter the uncommon cough. Just when I began to get my feet on the ground. Let me tell you this. I've seen it stay good and I've seen it turn awful. And I've seen ever, just about everything in between. But I've never seen anything like the uncommon cough. Nothing. Even if they do open it back up, we'll have to go back to running a society we know nothing about anymore. Then... I start hearing all manner of strange things are happening. I don't know if I believe half of it. I'm sensitive to things going on in the world around me for some reason. And for the past five days, it's been nothing but spider sense, spider sense, spider sense. Something really, really terrible is about to happen. Really bad. I don't mean something like, hey, another movie came out that disobeyed the storyline. I don't mean something like... Someone died R.I.P. I mean, I mean terrible. And something terrible already did happen. More than once. More than twice. We've lost our way. As a result. And the, ma the majority seems to not even want to get it back. They seem to think nothing of value was lost. It's okay not to work 24-7. It's okay to have fun. It's okay to goof off sometimes. It's okay to tell jokes that are funny and laugh at them. It's okay to swear sometimes. It's okay to drink in moderation. To sit outside with a couple of buds and crack open a beer. That's alright. It's okay to listen to the radio. It's okay to watch TV. It's okay to just put on your favorite movie, sit back and relax for a while. It's okay to all have dinner at the same time. With the rest of your families.
it's okay to put the phone down for a week or more. That's what an answering machine is for. That's what text messages are for. That's what emails are for. Life isn't to be lived at breakneck speed or you'll break your neck. Not 24-7 at least. It's okay to stop. To turn back. To look around. To back up when you're going down the wrong road. It's okay to admit you've made a mistake. It's okay to know when you're right. Even when it's not. What everybody else says is right. It is definitely okay to be different. There are many things you can do a different way without hurting a single person. It's okay to be human and make mistakes. What really counts is, did you learn from them? Are you trying your best? How good of a person are you trying to be overall? This other superficial stuff? I guess it matters more to you because you have good vision. But I'm basically blind. And I basically grew up blind. And I learned from the word go. That it's really the personality that counts. It's really the heart that counts. I have no idea where we're going, even with the clues I've been clued into. But the little bit I've seen, I absolutely hate. And that's my God-given right as an American citizen. free choice don't get me wrong there is definitely a group of people trying to control a lot of things but they don't have as much control as they'd like us to believe It's not predestined, and it's not all a predetermined path like I thought it was. There are many predetermined paths, but there are others. It's up to all of us to find which one works for them. The 
These people who are trying to control us, they are not strong in any way, shape, or form. They are weak. They need this. They need to know that their plan is working. They need to know that they're getting the supply they need to survive like a vampire. Because they got nothing inside of them. They got nothing inside of them. When the curtain falls and all the lights go out, they got nothing inside of them. Not a thing. And that's the difference between us and them. We're not superficial. They are. We walk the long roads. And damn it, we succeed. I'd like to even see them try to live like we do and still be happy. Because at the end of the day, the happiness comes from within or it does not exist. Later.